Hello everybody, my name is Aaron, aka Pulling Teeth, and welcome to, or welcome back to the WWE Smackdown 2 Season Mode, and it's time for the King of the Ring, and this is a very, very weird King of the Ring. Austin, Kane, Sean, for some reason Vince, Grandmaster Sexy, were in there, Bubba Ray Dudley, and... This is a very random King of the Ring. All that talk going into this from Kurt Angle of, I will be king again, and he's not even in it. Austin and his shitty knee. Or shitty knees, if you've been keeping up with everything that was happening in the past couple of episodes. Oh, and Austin wins. Austin advances, wipes out Kane in round one. The King of the Ring is, of course, where Austin's famous Austin 316 came from. Not this King of the Ring. It was King of the Ring 96. I want to say 96. We'll go with that. So Dwayne's here. And he's very confused by Billy Gunn's presence. Don't know why. It would make sense if this was like a first run through where Billy Gunn's not already unlocked. However, Billy Gunn is already unlocked. So it's just very confusing. I realise going through, not everybody is unlocked. So wherever I started this season from, I'd not got all the way through before I'd restarted it. Kick his ass, Sean. Kick his ass, Sean. Kick his ass, Sean. Come on, Sean. God damn it. Though, of course, obviously... Austin McMahon makes sense. It's unfortunate that he's in this and unfortunate that he's got this far already. One of the eight top young superstars. Oh no, Mick. You're falling for the raspberry lollipops too. Mick, don't do it, Mick. Mick, no. Mick, no. Oh, you wanted cherry, didn't you? It wasn't raspberry for you. It was cherry that led you in. Damn it, Mick. They know all your weaknesses. Billy Gunn just wants one main event. <laughs> That's all he wants. One pay-per-view main event. All right. Well, we've got the Grand Master. Let's do this. Me and GMS. Doesn't sound as good when you call him GMS. I'm surprised they never actually shortened the names. GMS and S2S. That one have worked. Yeah, I see why they didn't shorten him. Sometimes it's just Grandmaster and Scotty. And the big quiche, obviously, the big quiche. We all love the big quiche. Too Cool have got the best stances in this game. Just idle animations for Too Cool are fantastic. Scotty and Grandmaster anyway. And their entrance is fantastic too. You know what I mean? They're just constantly dancing. Okay. You neckbreaker in me, I'm neckbreaker in you. Oh no. He caught me by the foot. He likes that neckbreaker. Quicker than I expected him to be, not gonna lie. Although he can eat a drop kick. Lariat! Ryan the dingling! We do not want you to give Cherry Lawler any more family. <laughs> this Lariat didn't work. Lariat! That one did. Pile! No. Pile driver! And then an even. That's not an even flow. That's an even flow. 
Now get out of my ring. I said get out of my ring, not roll right back in it. Get out of my ring. And stay out of my ring. Screw it, I'm coming out of my ring. <laughs> Slap him in the face and hit him in the balls. <laughs> the ultimate combination. Pile driver. Choke him out. Choke him out. Rebound. Slap. <laughs> Pin him. Pin him off the rebound slap. Ah. Oh. In the corner. Razzle, dazzle, butt throw. Oh wow, it kicked out straight away. Completely no sold the butts. The butts? The buttocks. He no sold the buttocks. How dare you no sell my arse cheeks. Oh god. Oh god no. Actually that looked kinda cool. The missile drop kicks kinda of badass. Right in the groin. As far as I get away with as many shots to the groin as I do. Lariat and drop him like it's hot and he's out KO'd we're moving on hell yeah moving on up now moving on up moving on up alright so we've got to face the winner of Bubba and Benoit, was that right? I think that was it. Well, we've got history with Bubba. What everyone wants to see here tonight is me standing with my hand raised in victory. Billy, you weren't even on the card when the match started. Don't even know why you're here. You're probably still not on the card, but you're probably about to be added to the card and facing the rock in the main. Yeah, Bubba and Benoit. Okay. Who's walking away victorious in this one? I'm hoping Bubba, because we've got history with Bubba. We've got a lot of history with Bubba. Of course it isn't Bubba. We have to keep the two worst people in the world in this tournament as long as possible. Well, hopefully, Austin wipes out McMahon and I can wipe out Benoit. So, that's that's the hope, anyway. Come on, Austin. Need me and you in the finals. Me and thee. Good God! <laughs> alright. Okay, alright. We're, we're alright with that. <laughs> that was scary for a second. <laughs> Okay. Me and you, Chris, unfortunately. We'll do his best here. I better not lose to you. <laughs> Knowing a lot of these earlier games, you were very OP. Like, exceptionally so. Okay. We can beat him though. I, I have faith in us. We knocked out Grandmaster Sexy. Does he have a shitty neck yet? I don't think he has a shitty neck yet. So the pile drivers repeatedly are not going to do much. Of course he's just reversing everything I do, but boom! Right in the little family jewels. Right in the groin. Right in your nut sack. And again to the nut sack. And one more time to the nut sack. Use what I know to my advantage. It was just a beat down in the ropes for a second. And going under. He's so confused. There again. 
This match has just become cock and ball torture, the match. <laughs> Again. Hey, it's working. People might take the piss, but hey, it's working. And then punch him in the face. I get hit with a neck breaker, obviously, because good things can't last forever. Oh! <laughs> oh, that wasn't the move I intended, but sure. Get up. Razzle, dazzle, butt throw. You didn't even fall out of the corner after the butt throw. Up and pile driver. Even flow. Nope. Lariat. Don't know how my lariat didn't connect to you, but it connects to everyone else. Wonderful now I'm being German. Only two though. And off the barricade. Catch me. Kind of. No, back out. Oh, I missed it with a baseball slide. That would have been sweet. <laughs> Get to the groin. Even flow. We're done here. Before we even get to finish the territory. Two, My god, we actually are. <laughs> okay. That's a hell of a way to advance to the semi-final. Just repeatedly hit your opponent in the balls until they stop getting back up. Repeated shots of the balls, drop over the flow DDT, and we're done. You know, it's sound strategy. Alright, finals. Us and Stone Cold. King of the Ring 96. Going for a double. Or oh, is it going to be the first Queen of the Ring? Surprised they never gave China the King of the Ring, actually. That would have been cool. I gave her a slot in the Rumble. Gave her the first female to win an IC title. I think that she was the first woman to get a WWF Championship match. I'm surprised they never gave a King in the Ring. I think it could have been awesome. So they gave it to Billy Gunn, didn't they, in 1999? I would have thought that would have been a good year for him to give it to China. Did Austin just do a leapfrog? Steve, where did you ever leapfrog? Your knees are like made out of paper. Even flow. Don't leapfrog, Steve. Your knees can't take it. Oh god, more sidewalk slams. He likes the sidewalks. He thinks they're pretty this time of year. Razzle, dazzle, butt throw. The move works tremendously in the corner. Hardy's. Slap. <laughs> when in doubt, slap. Oh, up, oh, bye, Steve. Steve's moving surprisingly quickly. I don't know why, I didn't expect him to have this sort of speed. He's stringing combos together and everything. Like surprisingly effective. Alright, just backflip into getting hit with another sidewalk slam. Lariat! Oh, that was going to be a pile driver who recovered in time. Pile driver. On that stack of downs you call a neck. Even flow. Again, another leapfrog. He got caught straight with a slap. Throw you by your dodgy knees. Alright. Hey. No, none of that. <laughs> none of that. There could be families watching. 
Can't be fucking swearing at me. <laughs> Alright, drop him on this stack of dimes, never mind. Alright, you asked for it. I wasn't gonna do it. I wasn't gonna do it. Steve no selling, clearly he's decided to wear a cup. Uh oh. It's a nice exchange for a second. Run it! File drop, no. Lariat. God damn it. Lariat. Even flow. Not the move I was intending to do, but we'll take it. Pile driver. Stack of dimes. Get up. Drop you. Like it's hot. We're done here. Two, Queen of the ring. God damn. Steep up a bit of a fight towards the end there. But we are the queen of the ring. I gotta admit, when I woke up this morning, I never expected to shout, I am the queen. Anyway. Queen of the ring. Rock and Billy. Rockabilly ending the show. Come on, Rock, you're beating literally everybody else. There we go. I was about to say, some of the names that you've beaten leading up to this, surely you could beat Billy Gunn. <coughs> Still not defending his title, though. Which is curious. He seems to just never want to defend his championship. Oh, Billy's pissed, even though he's smiling. Oh, it's slapping the camera, man. That's mean. That's a fine. Somebody find that fine ass. That picture of Kurt Angle is just so weird. But either way, we won <laughs> King of the Ring. So we're going to leave that episode there. So thank you everybody so much for joining me in this one. It has been a genuine pleasure as per usual. Like, comment, subscribe. You know the drill. All the fun stuff. And we'll see you in the next one. Bye.